Do you think that if you've got if you had got ahead of yourself and you hadn't been that ordinary bugger or that you've been called the battler's billionaire, mm. do you think that's part of your success, not getting ahead of yourself? Well, it may be, um, because um, you know I'm, I'm involved a bit with Nathan Tinkler at the moment, who's a very interesting character that was in exactly the opposite of me, and I've talked to him about it. You know, like, mate, you're 36 and you're a big shot and you're a nobody and you actually think you're a big shot, which is a huge problem. I oh, know I don't. Yes, you do, the way you go on. So um, uh, it goes to their head. And, and so I'm a great observer of people, successful people at, in any sphere, and, and trying to, you know, because I, you, you, if someone's successful at something, whatever it is, you should look at it. Why is that bloke the number one tennis player in the world? Or even the number 10, or number one in Australia? Why did he get there and the other bloke didn't? And, and just try to, is it just skill? Did he work a bit harder? And then you go through all these different people that actually, and he'll tell you, they'll all tell you, oh, there was a bloke that had more ability than me. Don't worry about that. I worked harder than him. So we should put you, we should get a seat here and you can come with us and do the next interviews <laughs> too because this is the series. This is what we're, we're really fascinated in. Yeah, so um, it's, 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 it's a case of uh, these people, something goes in their head. You know, I watched Bernard Tomic play tennis the other night and he's supposed to be gone in the head. The, I, I saw him play Djokovic and he beat Djokovic, right? He's not, he can't do that. But he did. He, he, was, he went into the zone. Now, if you can figure, ever figure out how to get into that zone, Anyone that's ever played any sport is, knows what the zone is. If, if you play football or golf or whatever, cricket, whatever it is, if you ever get into that zone sometimes, you think to yourself, wow, I was going, you know? And, and then you think, how can I get back there again? And the next time you do it, you're miles away from it. How does that work? How, what, if he could play every game like he played against Djokovic, I watched that and I thought, that's just sensational. He just did everything exactly right. He was in the zone. And you think about that in business. Can you get into the zone? 